Hey everyone, I'm Matt. Welcome back to another video. Today, I am super excited. We are taking a look at a fifth wheel that I've never seen this floor plan design before. It is so awesome and so great for the person who is trying to work on the road. I know you're going to love this floor plan. This is a 2022 Heartland Milestone Model 360 HP. We are going to be taking a look at the outside features first and the inside features. Then we're going to give you three things we love about the milestone and three things we dislike about it. We're starting in three, two, one. Hey everyone again, welcome back to another video again today. I am super excited to be showing you this awesome milestone. What an amazing floor plan. Before I begin, gotta say hi to Will. Hey Will, hey guys. how's it going today? It's going good. Guys, as you heard a couple days ago, we are back at General RV. Yes. And the reason we're back is to bring you guys the best price in America. And hang tight because when you hear the price of this unit, it's gonna shock you. Well, this unit is priced really amazing. Yes. But even more amazing is a floor plan. Okay. Let's begin. Cool. Model is Milestone 360 HP. The actual tip tip length is 41 feet 1 inch. Well, the dry weight is 11,632 pounds and the hitch weight is 2,375 pounds. Well, this is an absolutely amazing fifth wheel. And again, this fifth wheel is made to be at a certain price point, okay? Obviously, there's gonna be better, more luxurious fifth wheels, but dollar for dollar, as I like to say a lot, pound for pound, this milestone is going very far. Right up front here, we do have a nice painted fiberglass front cap. Very nice. This is the Rotoflex trailer pin box right here from Lippert. And then down there, well, you can see the inverter, no generator prep. Uh, you got your batteries there, and it is good for storage. I believe it is generator prepped, actually. Oh, there you go. Coming on down the side here, this does have four-point electric auto leveling. Coming on down the side here, well, you can see that there is a very nice power awning with LED lights. Three-year structural warranty right there. And then here, you can see that it does have your propane tank here. And on the other side, and then here is storage underneath. Good amounts of storage. You can see the aluminum framing. And then right here, you do have a place if you wanna have a TV on the outside. All right. And then coming on down, we do have speakers on the outside. Because this is a Heartland wheel, they do use Asdell. Asdell is a green base material that will never delaminate on you. And this does have the weather guard, optimal thermal protection, which is a heated and closed underbelly with heating pads on the tanks. And you do have these awesome solid steps. And then look at these tires. Well, they're trailer kings. I love those. These are the ST235-80R16. And then look at this. The Moride CRE 3000 suspension. That's very nice. It is. Coming around the back wheel. No bumper for your stinky slinky. You do have a hitch. 300 pounds of vertical weight on the hitch. It is prepped for the Furion backup camera. And again, guys, I am going to start climbing up the ladders again. But unfortunately, last night was Halloween and I rolled my ankle and it hurts real bad. So yeah. I'm not gonna do it for the next couple of videos. Couple videos. But we will start getting up on the roofs again and showing everybody the roofs. This is gonna be a one piece uh, TPO roof with two air conditioning units on top. Cool. Do Make sure you guys smash that thumbs up button. Do no. Want me to climb the roof for you? Not mm. that one, sir. Right. Maybe the one like your ladder on your fifth yeah. wheel. Right there, 50 amp service. Here's where you have your gray tank number two. Okay. Sewer outlet connection right there. And then coming on down here. Gray tank number one, sewer outlet connection. Cool. Right here is going to be a six gallon water heater. And then here is going to be everything else that you want. It's your water hookup, potable water fill, potable, potable. Black tank flush, outdoor shower, very nice. And another propane tank. Well, the outside of this fifth wheel looks good, but I'm telling you, it is the inside that looks even better. Let's go take a look. All right. Uh -huh. <laughs> One footed skip. Check it out, Will. Okay, I haven't even seen it myself yet. Oh, 
All right, we'll start up front. Nice big bedroom up here. Bathroom right here connects through uh, the bedroom as well. And then coming down, you have your living area, dining nice area, kitchen. and kitchen here. And a nice pantry there. Okay. Well, well, before we show everybody the inside, let's give a big shout out to Lipper. This episode is sponsored by Kurt. There's a reason why manufacturers are all switching over to the Kurt Rotoflex pin box. Jen and I went with the Kurt A16 fifth wheel hitch. Uh, this is perfect for our truck because we do have a short bed and it's on the slider. And it also makes it very user friendly with the red, yellow, and green symbols telling you whether it's safe to tow or not. With this hitch, it also, it wraps around the pin of the fifth wheel hitch so that it has the best connection and makes for the smoothest ride. This hitch also articulates in each direction so that you have much less chucking while going down the road. Making it a smoother ride and the best riding experience when yes. towing a fifth wheel. That's why Will chose the Kurt A16. That's why the manufacturers are using the Kurt Rotoflex pin box. Thank you so much for Kurt for sponsoring this yes, video. Let's continue the video. Why are you smiling? Because <laughs> I see what it is back there. It's just the pantry. Don't worry about is it. Is it? Okay. Well, we're back inside. Okay. And we're starting with the kitchen. But I'm doing the kitchen. Okay. I'm going to start with the pantry. You know why? Why? Because it ain't a pantry, Well, <laughs> Look at this. That's really cool. We are starting back here. Well, it's a little office area. This is awesome. <sighs> wow. So smart right especially so like our friend matt valdez what's up don't even tell him that we mentioned him in the video let's see if he watches we'll see if he watches yeah okay <laughs> we'll see how good of a friend you are matt right here um he works for somebody important and he works from the road and i imagine he talks about stuff that he doesn't want his family hearing about you know what i'm saying or just right. needs privacy so to have a you know what i'm saying yeah to have a like, little bit of like you're work, like he's working yeah right and so you know you don't want four-year-olds running around or his kids which is 10 year olds running around you know playing football on legos yeah while you're on a business meeting you want to have something closed off and shut off so um that's what's so neat about this that is really cool right here you have a nice little desk area and i do love how it just looks like a pantry yeah Oh, did I show that? I don't think so. Well, you got that and a little bit more there. Well, this is so neat. And this is the perfect little office area. And there is air ducts coming in here as well. Oh, nice. Coming on over here, we'll go straight over to the dining room. Okay. It's right here, table and chairs, okay? So one of the chairs is one of the chairs for the uh, office area. Okay. You have your balances here. MCD slow rise shades, I like that. Yeah. That's pretty unique. Nice lights right there. And then look at this living room area. You still get the double sofas. I love this. That is really cool. Yep. Did you see the little cup holders on the side too come out? What, what you talking about? I oh. Think. Yeah. Yes, sir. And a USB. USB. That's cool. These are the Thomas Payne collection. You got your remote holders there. These were climbing out. Whatever. You know, you know what it does. Yep. These recline out and you're looking directly across at that TV entertainment center. Well, look at this. When it's up, then it's stuck. And then when it goes all the way down, well, it is super, uber nice. You've got a nice fireplace down there. Yes, what produces, is nice? Oops, sorry, Will. No, produces heat from electricity. What I are you gonna say? I interrupted you. Oh, a um, little bit of storage there and everything. And the TV's almost down. Oh, well. <laughs> oh, Jeez, that damn. was loud. That scared me. And then check this out. This is what it's about. This is nice. When you don't want the TV up, you want to have that nice big window there. Yep. And then over here is a sofa. Good for two people. It does tri-fold out to make an additional sleeping area. We got storage there. There you go. Storage there. And a little bit more storage there. Very nice. So I kind of see like a little problem with that. It probably would have been better to put the handles here, huh? Like for, for me, it's not a problem, but for most. For most short people, yeah. well. Well, well, do you know what time it is? 
It's now time for the MSRP. Well, this is exciting. Okay. Exciting times that we're in. MSRP on this fifth wheel here, stock number 267137, is $102,929 will MSRP. But as you guys heard, we are back with General RV, and this one's at the Tampa store. And it is 36% wow. off MSRP to $65,999. That's Will, crazy. That's an absolutely fantastic price. That is the best price in America. I can promise you that. Yeah. And if you guys want to get the price in the best price in America, click our links down below. Go to generalrv.com backslash Matt's Cash. Fill out the form. That way my team, our, my team, our team, is going to work with you to get you this unit or any unit, the best price in America. Go, if you can't find that link down below, just go to our website, mattsrvreviews.com, fill out the contact app, or call 844-969-4033. Will, that is the hotline to our team. Guys, the reason why we came back is because now Will and I are working hand in hand, so it doesn't matter if you want to get this fifth wheel, a motorhome, a freaking pop-up, if you guys call our team at General RV, it doesn't matter where you live in the country, we are going to get you the best price in America. Also, we are going to make it where you can pick it up. Like, if you want this unit and you live in freaking Michigan, we can send it to the Michigan store, whatever the most convenient for you. This unit being here at Tampa, and Tampa's lovely, come to Tampa. That's right. Well, let's continue the video. All right, we'll start with this storage up top here. Very nice, above the pantry. <laughs> Nice little nook there, more storage there, some shelves here, nice backsplash, this would make a, a good taco bar or coffee bar. Sure would. Um, I like how they put the plug over here in the corner, that's something Jen has always said is important with your coffee maker, and then you do have a wireless charger there, a little bit of storage there, look at the little doggy bowls. Yes. And more storage there. What is nice is the dog bowls are out of the way. You're not going to kick over yeah. the water, which is really annoying. Yep. And you don't need to move it for transport days. Exactly, yeah. Up top here, you got some storage in there as well. Nice big graystone microwave right there. Yes, sir. Small window on your camping side. A little bit of counters, top space next to the three burner Furion cooktop right here. Yes, sir. With the blue lights and oven. You know what's funny, Will? What? So Lauren's here today, yeah. CEO of, um, owner of General RV. And it's just a coincidence. Yeah. But you know, everybody at the Tampa store probably thinks he's here because of us. Probably. Like, like, <laughs> we're, like we're important. <laughs> Some a nice uh, Furion refrigerator Wow, here. I, like I love new... that. Is this fridge and this is freezer? I forget how they yeah. did this. Is that yeah. what it is? I don't yeah. know. No, that's all freezer. This is all freezer. So that's like for your like fresh fruits. Fruits. Fresh fruits. Okay. Yeah, very nice. And then over here. And well, I mean, we are important, but you yeah, know. Not that important. <laughs> um, nice spray faucet right there. Yes. Solid surface inserts and solid surface countertops. Yes, nice very nice. Big single bowl sink. Drawer right here. Yes, sir. And here. A little bit of storage there. Very nice. And to wrap it up right there. You got that one? Very good. Cool. All right. Well, let's check out that bathroom. All right. It's an interesting bathroom. It is. Okay. Oh, wow. Ooh. This is not good for a fifth wheel. Not for a fifth wheel. How do you feel in there? Well, my head's turned uh. and all the way against. Like, you'd have to stand here, and it's just, it's just not practical. This definitely fails. And it's a little small, anyways. All right, right over here, we do have the medicine cabinet and a nice little sink action. You know what? Well, I wore pants today to try to be respectful. It was a mistake, wasn't it? The shorts are coming back tomorrow. Okay. Right there, we do have um, that and this. Okay. You know, first day back, you know, you. But. He pants are killing me. <laughs> Porcelain. And. They're too long, aren't they? Well, every pants are too. My shorts are too long for me. Yeah. Porcelain. Well, this is a prime pooping position. Bing. There you go. Very nice. At least that passes. Yeah, the red shirt's back. There you go. Did we show this already? We did not. 
Okay, nice little bathroom storage closet space here and a drawer right there. And then turning around. Yes, get turned. Yeah. Over here. Nice. Is this a king size bed? It is. It's a big bed. I really like that and I like how it's kind of all open. Yeah. And I like how you have a lot of storage on that side. Right. So there's no storage on that side, but there's double storage on that side. Well, and this is nice too because since the bathroom is right there, yep. you know, you actually have room to walk there. Right. And you still have room to walk on this side yeah. as well. Very big closet. It is prepped for a washer dryer. Okay. You can see it side right there. Side. Yeah. Okay. Um, nice doors. You know what I'm saying? Good, yep. good look. TV right here. Nice drawers. Very nice drawers. You know what I'm saying? I mean, the woodwork, it's entry level. I yeah, mean, yeah. But again, that price point, man. Right. And then right there, storage underneath. And Will. Yeah. That's it. That's the review. Second review back with General RV. Now, before everybody leaves, it's time we give you three things we love and three things we don't like. Will, what do we do first? Three things we dislike. I got two straight on the outside. Okay. Dislike number one, Will. As you guys know, Will has four point electric leveling on his fifth wheel and we don't like it. We we don't mind that it's electric because it is a better price point, but it should definitely always be six point auto leveling on any size fifth wheel in our opinion. That is dislike number one. Will, dislike number two, sticking to the outside again, two videos in a row no clothes handle i hate these little twisties I, I hated them on a travel trailer but well i definitely hate them on a fifth wheel right the slam latch you know it's closed you know it's there i just much prefer the slam latch will that's dislike number two will tell me number third all right we're gonna come down here okay and you're gonna think i'm crazy at you first. are crazy but hear me out whoa you best oh my gosh so i love hey I, love I mean, back here. Matt's RV reviews is with, back with General RV. I don't know if Will's gonna <laughs> continue to remain with General. You you better watch yourself. No, I love this room and I love the whole concept back here. But one thing I was thinking about is my laptop, Jen's laptop, would never fit here. They really needed to do this a little bit deeper. Okay, smart. Especially since they do have the room in yeah, here. Yeah, smart. You know? Smart. So okay, well, that's three things we don't like about it, Will. Now it's time for three things we love about this. Okay. Number one, I love that office I there. Do too. Well, you do make a valid point, so you get to stay on the show. Okay. But the fact of just having a little office here is awesome. It's so awesome. That's I agree. number one. Well, I'm gonna tell you number two. Okay. It's gonna be this living room area. Yeah. So so many times to squeeze an office like that or a bunk room. They're only giving you one sofa. Yep. The fact that they still gave you the two and they designed it so well where you're able to keep this and that, maintain the right length, that's that's something that we really do like about it. So that's number two. And then Will, tell me number three. Number three, to kind of piggyback off of that, again, when you have a bunk room like that, a lot of times- Office. Kitchen, well, I know, but I'm just saying oh. like when you have another room back there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, a lot of times your kitchen lacks too. But I love how big this island is. Yep. And I love how they still got a really good sized taco slash coffee bar. In. I love it, Will. Yeah. And again, a lot of people, they're going to be looking at this like it's cheap. And it is cheap. Yeah. And that's the whole thing. It is cheap. It's a great way of getting a fifth wheel, truthfully, at some luxury travel trailer pricing. Yes. Well, Will, that's it. That's the review. Thank you guys so much for watching. Again, if you guys are interested in getting the best deal in America, on this fifth wheel or any RV whatsoever, click our links down below, generalrv.com backslash Matt's Cash, mattsrvreviews.com, we'll send you to generalrv.com, or call 844-969-4033. Will and myself, we have a team now that will get back to you ASAP and to make sure that we get you guys the best price in America That's on right. any unit whatsoever. Will, what do you want to say? Yeah, guys, thank you all so much for watching. I was really, really shocked with this unit. I love that concept. And truthfully, it's just the direction that people are going in these days. Yes. Um, you know, luckily, unluckily, the RV industry is all about R&D, as we call it, research and duplicate. And we're going to see that duplicated. We are. And I'm actually excited to see that duplicated. Um, make sure to leave down in the comments below. Let us know three things you like, three things you dislike. Make sure to smash the thumbs up button and subscribe. Thank you absolutely everybody yes, so much you. for watching and we'll, we'll see you next time.